From 1905 to 1915, Alessandro Anzani built a number of three-cylinder fan and radial engines, one of which powered Louis Blériot's 1909 cross-channel flight. An Anzani three-cylinder engine that powers a Blériot 11 based in England is thought to be the oldest airworthy engine in the world. Topic. Design and development Alessandro Anzani began building motorcycle engines in France around 1905. Unusually, his motors were air rather than water-cooled, making them light. His first designs were two-cylinder V engines, and he rode machines powered by them to records and race success in 1905 and 1906. In the same period he had developed a three-cylinder version, more powerful than the twins. As the image shows, the engine fitted neatly into the cycle frame. Engines with cylinders arranged radially but only in the upper half circle were termed fan type, or semi radials. By about 1910, other manufacturers were building, e.g., five cylinder fan engines, most notably REP. Three cylinder fans were known as W or W3 engines. The appeal of the fan configuration was that, because all the cylinder were above the horizontal, there was little danger of the plugs being fouled by the lubricating oil. The disadvantage, particularly for an aircraft engine, was the extra weight required to counterbalance the pistons. In response to the growing interest in aviation in France after the Wright brothers' visit in 1908, Anzani produced the first of a series of three-cylinder fan flight engines. The cylinders were each a single iron casting and the one-piece crankcase was aluminium. Pistons were steel with cast rings. In most of these the outer cylinders were at 60 degrees to the central one, though a contemporary diagram shows one, described as the cross-channel engine, with a 55 degrees angle. They were all air-cooled side valve engines, each exhaust valve was controlled from below by a cam in the crankcase. Each was mounted in a cell to the side of the cylinder, with the automatic, atmospheric pressure-driven spring-loaded inlet valve immediately above it, partly to minimize volume and partly to help cool the hot exhaust valve. Most contemporary and pre-1921 sources agree that the bores of these early engines were between 100 and 105 mm 3.93 and 4.13 in, but strokes between 120 and 150 mm 4.72 and 5.90 in are quoted. Most put the output of these engines at about 18 kilowatts, 24 horsepower, at around 1,400 to 1,600 revolutions per minute. It was an engine of this sort that famously powered Louis Blériot's Type 11 monoplane across La Manche, the English Channel, on the 25th of July 1909. Contemporary sources differ on its bore, stroke, and swept volume. The first description of the successful machine in flight describes the engine as having dimensions of 100 times 150 mm, or a capacity of 3.53 liters. However, a few months later they printed the engineering drawing of the 55 degrees engine, which has dimensions of 103 by 120 mm marked on it, clearly captioned as used in the cross channel flight. If their identification was right, then Blériot used a 3.00 liter engine. A head-on photograph of the cross-channel aircraft also shows a 55 degrees engine. Even before the channel flight, Anzani was selling more powerful versions with larger bores, a 120 mm bore, 4.4 liter, 269 cu variant produced 26 kilowatts, 35 horsepower, and a 135 mm bore, 6.4 liter, 390 cu in engine gave 36 kilowatts, 45 horsepower. These fan engines remained in production until at least 1913, though there were important improvements. The exhaust valve was moved to the cylinder head and operated by rockers via push rods, and a mixing chamber was arranged in the crankcase. 
The 1913 three-cylinder Anzani fan engine had a cylinder separation of 72 degrees, presumably to lighten the counterbalance. By this stage it had its inlet manifold at the rear of the engine to minimize airflow cooling of the fuel-air mixture. Topic. Radial y engines Anzani was aware of the weight cost of the counterweight in the fan configuration and by December 1909 he had a symmetric 120 degrees three-cylinder radial engine running. One example was a 3.1 liter 186 cu in unit producing 22 kilowatts 30 horsepower at 1300 revolutions per minute. Although termed the Y engine after its symmetric cylinder arrangement, it ran in an inverted Y position so that the plugs mounted on the upper in plain side of the two lower cylinders were less than 30 degrees below the horizontal and less prone to oiling than one serving a piston at 180 degrees from upright. Radials are smoother running than the less symmetric fan engines as well as lower weight but with the low power available from their three cylinders they had limited applications. They led, however, to Anzani's two-row radial engines, beginning with the six-cylinder radials, two Ys on a common crankshaft. In the 21st century a restored Blériot 11 bearing the French Blériot factory serial number 56, said to be the oldest flyable aircraft in the Western Hemisphere, bearing the American registration N60094, is still flown in the United States on summer and early autumn weekends with one of these 120 degrees cylinder angle Y type radial engines. Topic variants. Topic Anzani three cylinder fan engines. Output power, bore time stroke, capacity 10 to 12 horsepower, 7.5 to 9 kilowatts, 3.35 in times 3.35 in 85 millimeters times 85 millimeters, 88.5 cu in 1.45 L, 12 to 15 horsepower, 9 to 11 kilowatts. 3.35 in times 3.94 in 85 mm times 100 mm, 104 cu in 1.70 L, 25 to 30 horsepower, 19 to 23 kilowatts, 4.13 in times 5.12 in 105 mm times 130 mm, 206 cu in 3.38 L. 40 to 45 horsepower 30 to 34 kilowatts 5.32 in times 5.92 in 135 millimeters times 150 millimeters 393 cu in 6 44 l 45 to 50 horsepower 34 to 38 kilowatts topic Anzani three-cylinder inverted Y radial engines. 30 horsepower. Topic: Applications. Blériot 11. Caproni Pinsuti triplane. Depardussin Type A. Defoe 4. Muller GMG 2 Medwetsky HL2 Perry Beetle T.1 Rob Katzenstein RK.9 Grasmic Sikorsky S1 Sikorsky S2 Stelmachik S.1 Bazina VIH Holland H 1 Topic. Survivors 
the restored and flyable Blériot 11, with French Blériot factory serial number 56 and registry number N60094 at Old Rhinebeck Aerodrome uses one of these Anzani three-cylinder, true radial, engines for its straight-line, short-distance, hop, flights. Another Blériot 11, with British registration Jiang and said to be only three weeks older than the old Rhinebeck example, is allowed to fly similar short hops at the Shuttleworth collection. Its original, fan-type, Anzani three-cylinder engine is thought to be the oldest airworthy aircraft engine in the world. A 1910 Depardussin monoplane that is also restricted to straight hops uses a Y-type Anzani engine. Topic. Engines on display The Shuttleworth collection also holds preserved examples of Anzani three-cylinder engines on static display. At the Museo Nacional de Aeronautica Argentina there is a three-cylinder Anzani semiradial in working order installed on a Blériot 11. A Y three-cylinder engine is on display at the engines hall at the same museum. Brooklyn's Museum, Weybridge, UK has an Anzani three-cylinder fan engine on static display. Topic. Specifications Data from flight, according to them, these specifications describe the channel flight engine. Topic. General characteristics Type, 3-cylinder air-cooled fan Bore, 100 mm 3.94 in Stroke, 150 mm 5.90 in Displacement, 3. 53 liters 216 cu in Dry weight, 65 kg 143 pounds Topic. Components Valve train, automatic inlet valves, mechanical exhaust valves driven from three separate cams in crankcase. One inlet, one exhaust per cylinder. Fuel system, Granville and Arquemborg carburetor, mixing chamber in crankcase. Oil system, splash lubrication. Cooling system, air, ribbed cylinders. Ignition, battery ignition, one spark plug per cylinder. Topic. See also Related lists List of aircraft engines <laughs>